Sporting associations, aunts and kids are monitoring the impact of COVID-19 on the hosting of their sporting events. The Federal Ministry of Education in a press release this week announced the postponement of the Rams Primary School Championship and the TDC Interschool Championship due to concerns over the coronavirus. The ministry said the two marquee sporting events originally scheduled for March 21 and 22 and March 27th to the 29th respectively were put on hold after extensive deliberations with all stakeholders and the advice of the Ministry of Health. Mr. Daryl Lloyd, permanent secretary in the Ministry of Youth and Sports, said, quote, The health and well-being of our citizens is of greatest priority, and the Ministry of Sports has taken a principled stance to ensure that we do not compromise anyone's health as we seek to prevent the spread of the COVID-19 pandemic, end quote. He further revealed that there will be continued discussions to determine future dates for the events once all the all-clear is given. The Ministry of Sports is charged with the development of athletes and other related stakeholders in the sporting sector. The release continued and it is also mandated to ensure that safety is a matter of priority while working towards such. The ministry thanked Eskin Athletics, which organizes the meet, the main sponsors Rams and TDC, the Ministry of Education and all other stakeholders for their continued support. Meanwhile, the St. Kitts Nevis Football Association said in a statement on Tuesday, it is monitoring the situation as it relates to COVID-19 and is prepared to take the necessary steps where required. It said, quote, our actions and decisions in response to the coronavirus will be guided by advice and recommendations from government of St. Kitts and Nevis through the Ministry of Health. Thus far, we have not been advised of any actions that should be taken by the Football Association in relation to the activities. However, we wish at this time to use the power of football to raise awareness designed to educate persons about preventative and precautionary measures which can be taken to combat the spread of this disease. The association encourages persons to wash or sanitize your hands frequently, especially before eating and after contact with people. Avoid touching your face, in particular eyes, nose, and mouth, as this can prevent the virus from entering your body. Cover your mouth and nose with a disposable tissue while coughing or sneezing and use the nearest waste receptacle to dispose of it after use. Avoid close contact within one meter or three feet, especially with people who display symptoms of the virus, such as cough or fever, and stay at home if you feel unwell, develop fever, or other respiratory symptoms. The association said it will keep in contact with all stakeholders to continue to monitor the situation as it develops locally. It says that football has the power to bring people together for a common good. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.